Alright, here we go again. Uh, we unfortunately just lost, but uh, we're going to hopefully rebound it. Hopefully that wasn't the end. I don't think so. Probably maybe almost expect you to lose that. Having a stroke again. Seizure. Is that right? The greatest superstars of all time under one roof? But Stone Cold Steve Austin ain't even on a car. That's because you have a neck injury. You think you can have a legend tour without Stone Cold Steve Austin? Jesus. Yeah. Thought you already went Bill through Hager this on your podcast. That's why again. Brock Lesnar can't be so you. So if you want to see Stone Cold in this damn show, give me a hell yeah. Stone Cold gonna die? Oh, yeah. Probably. So Jimmy Hart, you scrawny little pencil neck bastard, I suggest you put on your cheap sunglasses and your little suit <gasps> and bring your 98 pound ass down to this ring before Stone Cold comes back here and sticks that damn megaphone so far up your ass. Hey, you stole that from the rock. Silent but deadly's in the back row. The hell's in his other hand? It's two weeks in a row. Oh, he had two of those. And not for nothing, he's calling the megaphone. Look, Austin, it's true. You might be one of the greatest superstars of all time. But your actions last week are exactly the sort of thing I wanted to avoid. I mean, let's face it, Eddie. You're not the easiest guy to keep under control. You put, Vince McMahon so you put me in a hell in a cell with Mick Foley. Jesus Christ, what the hell is now, wrong with you? Not being formally invited, you managed to interfere anyway. And the fact is, I simply can't let you do that anymore. Can't? So we can do this the easy way, where you can just leave the ring and don't come back. Or we can do this the hard way. What a faggot. <laughs> hell, Jimmy. You know the Stone Cold what the fuck Steve is Austin wrong with this guy? What is wrong with him? him? Right, he Steve, needs medical I'm attention. Right, I guess I've got no choice but to call in the big guns. All right, I guess we have to wait a second. Yo, yo, yo! Hold on a second. Why would you hold on just one damn second, you mealy mouth bastard? <gasps> this. Is that what you call the big guns? No, no, that's not who I was talking about. Get back to the locker room and stay there. This has nothing to do with you. Look, I joined this. Who the hell is supposed to come out? Legends in the ring, not to sit on the sidelines and watch them beat the hell out of each other. Jimmy, if you're gonna up the ante, I want in. Well, that's just fine for the mouth of the south. Got a couple of special surprises I've been saving for something like this. We'll see you two in the ring for a tag team match later tonight. Well, normally Stone Cold don't like surprises, but now that you mention it, here's one for you. Another one? What the fuck? What the hell was that? After last week, you have to have a case of amnesia. Not to be ready for that. It don't matter who you bring to this damn ring, there ain't never gonna be a legend as big as me. And that's the bottom line, cause Stone Cold said so. Who the hell am I gonna face? The Basham Brothers? But they're not legends. What the fuck? What kind of a team is that? Jeez, he couldn't have like gotten the Heart Foundation or the Demolition, the Road Warriors, anybody? Bullcrap. We're gonna end it here, so yeah.